Today's Morning Minute, Being Attitude. Jesus is teaching in Matthew 5 what is called the Beatitudes. This is an attitude of being when we know our identity in Christ as a son or daughter in the family of God, as a dearly loved child of God, we come from a perspective of being, not doing. It is out of our being, being, we do. We've been made righteous, with right standing with God because of Christ Jesus. He who knew no sin became sin so that we could become the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus. We have right standing with God in Christ Jesus. We've been trained by the lies of this world. Now, the Father of all creation is sitting down teaching the truth of God's word to us. And we read in Matthew chapter 5, verses 1 and 2, and then in verse 6. In the Amplified, when Jesus saw the crowds, he went up on the mountain, and when he and, and when he was seated, when he was seated, his disciples came to him. Then he began to teach them, saying, and we move to verse six. Blessed, joyful, nourished by God's goodness are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, those who actively seek right standing with God, for they will be completely satisfied. Those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, they'll be completely satisfied. Jesus Christ paid the price to make us sons and daughters to bring us into right standing with God. Seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness. Seek and know you know, know that you have right standing with your Father. Seek Him with all your heart, mind, soul, and strength. Seek an intimate relationship with the Holy Spirit. Seek with all your heart to know the finished work of Jesus Christ on the cross. He has made you righteous, spotless, clean. He has forgiven, removed, and forget, forgotten all your sins. You've been trained, you've been trained by, you're, you're being trained by the very Father who knew you before he created the world. Let me say that again. You're being trained by the very Father who knew you before he created the world. Stop letting this perverse and corrupt generation train your thinking. Let the Holy Spirit lead and guide you. The Holy Spirit in you is your teacher, counselor, comforter, guide, and hope. When righteousness, right standing with God, hits your heart and soul, you will begin discerning the truth, the truth from lies. The Holy Spirit will reveal the truth living in you from the lies. The truth, the truth is you're a child of God. God loves you. You're a new creation in Christ Jesus. You have, you have the mind of Christ living in you through the Holy Spirit. You have a being attitude. Walk knowing that God loves you, your being, you are being made in God's image and likeness in love. Amen and amen.